I'm Fatima Shahama and I'm here giving you a presentation on the topic, the atmosphere. So what is the atmosphere? The envelope of air that surrounds the earth is called atmosphere. In the atmosphere, there are like particular gases and from them, 78% is covered by nitrogen, 21% is covered by oxygen, and 1% is covered by argon, carbon dioxide, and other gases. The atmosphere has like five layers. They are the troposphere, the stratosphere, the mesosphere, the thermosphere, and the exosphere. So each of those has a different role to play in the atmosphere. Let's go and see what they are. Number one, troposphere. It is the lowest layer and closest to the earth. It extends about eight kilometer over the poles and 18 kilometer over the equator. The temperature decreases with increase in height above the mean sea level. The water vapor and the dust particles are only found in this layer. This layer is the home of clouds, lightning, and weather phenomena, which means that we can only find the weather phenomenon in the troposphere. And the clouds, all of these are present only in the troposphere. Number two, the stratosphere. It is the second layer and it's present above the troposphere. It's 50 km high from the mean sea level. It's free from weather and the air moves horizontally. Thus, the jet planes fly in this layer. The temperature increases with increase in altitude. The lowest part of the layer contains the ozone layer which protects the Earth from the sun's harmful UV rays. As we all know, the sun has harmful rays called UV rays. And in the stratosphere, there is a combination of ozone molecules which forms the ozone layer. That, that layer protects the Earth from the harmful UV rays. Third, mesosphere. It's the third layer and it's present above the stratosphere. It extends from 50 to 80 km above the main sea level. The temperature decreases with increase in height. It's the coldest layer in the atmosphere. Meteors from outer space burn in this layer. As we all see, the meteorites, actually, we are actually seeing them from the third layer, the mesosphere. They're really big, you know? Number four, the thermosphere. It's the fourth layer and it's present above the mesosphere. It extends from 80 to 400 kilometer above the mean sea level. The temperature increases with increase in height. The lower part of this layer contains ionosphere, which reflects low-frequency radio waves back to the Earth. This helps in long-distance communication. And as we all know, the northern light or the aurora borealis is present in this layer. And whenever we talk or make a phone call, the long-distance communication is also held by this layer. Number five, the exosphere. It's the uppermost layer and it gradually merges into outer space. Light gases like helium and hydrogen are found here and the temperature increases with height. So the exosphere is mostly like the outer space. It's just the outer space. Thank you. Hope you have enjoyed my presentation.